it's Karina with Karina Loves to Plan. Welcome back to my channel. So here I am back with another spread in my mini happy planner dashboard. And of course I'm going all Christmassy. Christmassy or wintery, but I um, just, I'm going to be using the Happy Year sticker book for all of my planner spreads this week. All right, let's get started. So the first thing I'm going to do as you normally know is I'm gonna cover up that area. Let's go find the stickers first. Okay. Now I'm debating what exactly to do, whether I want to go with this blue theme, which is beautiful, but I could save those stickers for January, or do another red theme and go with the stick. I think I'll go with the stickers that are in here already. So with that being said, I may have to cover this up. Yeah, I think what will happen is I will have to cover that up. And it might have to be with that sticker. I'm just trying to think. I don't want it to say winter bucket list because that's not what it's for. The list is going to be for... It's going to be for my dinners, but I'm finding that it's just so small. So I'm wondering what to do because I feel like it would be too much to white out the whole space. There goes my phone. Winter vibes, but none of the, the exact theme that I want to go for are these Santas with the llamas. So which full box sticker would go best with that? Wondering if it, it wouldn't be the winter vibes unless I went with this spread or those colors. You know what? I'm going to switch things around. I'm going to do that. Again, I want to keep things simple. I don't want to spend 45 minutes working on a spread. Now I realize by doing this, I am going to cover up part of the to buy. And it may not leave me enough room necessarily to, oh no, I'll make it work for the lunches. Okay. Okay, so far I can work with that. Then I'm going to cover up this Plan a Happy Life down here. Cover up the focus there as well. And then I'm going to make a little, I guess, collage of stickers. Although I have the Nutcracker already there. So maybe. Maybe do the Mouse King at the bottom, but he would just take up too much room. Yeah, I feel like I could put her there. Then. Gosh, these are huge stickers. I almost wish the Mouse King was facing the other way. Like, how do I put her down without cutting off her arm? Yeah, so I don't want to cut off her arm. I'll have to cut off part of her skirt, and that's okay. Then I'm gonna put, I'm just gonna white out this center line here. And then add little presents and decorations. Hope you guys can still see that. Presents and decorations like the drum. And 
because I can still do a list here as well. So I'm just wondering if there's enough Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Yeah, I'll make it work. Then, I like these are like the translucent stickers, but they have the color to them. It's not clear sticker paper, it's like clear sky blue. Okay, then I'm gonna put a label to go over her legs for the focus. that really cute. I'm gonna cover up a little bit more of the bottom down here with some more decorations because it just looks awkward or kind of standing there without any thing. Mm, I need a smaller one. to cover up some of that white out. Okay, so then I didn't want to go into another sticker book, but the Christmas Joy sticker book has the typewriter quotes that I love so much. And there's the light blue that would work well. Yeah, I love it. I don't want to put this because I don't necessarily want to put it on top of the girls, so. Cute. Okay, that part of the spread is done. Moving over to my actual dated page. So the top part here I'm going to white out again. And I've noticed actually the last few weeks, I haven't actually put dates on anything. I've forgotten date covers of all things. So I'm like, what was this week? So I have some leftover date covers from a another kit. So this is one of the reasons why I like kits is because of the date covers. So there's all the date covers down. Now I feel like I can go into a little bit more functional stuff. So my work schedule is going to go up here, but I'm trying to think of the best way to add decoration there without going super overboard. See, there's two pages of that Santa one. I should use that. It's okay. So maybe let's do candy cane. Actually, maybe I should have just done the candy cane and the every time I rip up a sticker. Oh, now I have to do the white out again. A little bit wonky but we'll make it work so that's my where my work schedule is going to go then i need to be able to put oh that's not sticker i need to-do lists on each page so after this page i know that there's not to-do lists so i need oh this is cute i will put him down on monday actually no i feel like i'll put him down on thursday because there are a few things happening that day. Okay, then. So I almost want to do like alternate boxes on different days. 
because they're cute and why not? So this box fits almost perfectly in there, super cute. Um, and then here I won't actually do a box, it will just be um, maybe it's not donating gifts, but well, maybe I could do like a little box, although there isn't actually a lot happening on that day. So maybe I could just do red and that would be enough. Or I could do red here. Oh. Okay, and I don't want to put red right next to each other, right? You kind of want to put red on different ones. And then this noted box is too big for the dashboard layout, so I don't think it'll work. Um, I'm gonna just maybe put this one here. And then I'll see if I can just do a today sticker. Um, this side, write down all the stuff that's happening for the day. Blues are right next to each other and that's not necessarily what I wanted. Okay, let's see if I can do green instead so I can have a mix of red, green, and that light blue here. And then I can put this today on this day, so I can still alternate. Cute! And then I can put something different there. Like a, I was gonna say red, but I've got red, so I can put another green on there. Maybe, maybe I'll just put a present there. And then maybe do the same thing for the Monday. Mm, I wanted the blue color, but there isn't really much left. It's harder than it seems, guys. I'm, I think I'm making it harder than it actually is. Okay, you know what? I will put the green up here so that I can write down what I'm doing for the day. Really simple boxes, mix of icons. I like it, it's cute. Now I'm gonna put the two pages together and see if there's anywhere else that I can add decoration. So maybe a little bit in the top right corner. Um, yeah. I always love putting decorations in that top corner. Then little candies where I can. And then I'm, again, I'm not gonna go crazy on it actually, just, it should be fine as is. I think that's it. I think I'm gonna leave it like that. It's simple but still really festive. All right, but that is it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. If you like this video, please leave me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye.